find our Bailey Burmaster live now with more. Bailey. Hey, David. Boom, Pinkin Stadium, rather quiet right now. Will not be the case on Saturday at 6 p.m. for that kickoff. Safety John Bonney calls it one of the hardest places to play in the Big 12. Meanwhile, defensive lineman Lonzel Gilmore specifically recalls the sound of the paddle people and where to find them. The unique upward build of the Boone Pickens Stadium gives it potential to be loud. In addition, Oklahoma State Athletics just put in a massive video board in the East End Zone, which occasionally pops up some scare tactics. Boone Pickens Stadiums now has that 100 foot by 50 foot giant video board. Um, recently, it featured a giant orange picture of Gary Busey. Uh, do you expect that might have any impact on a relatively inexperienced quarterback? And then, as a quick follow up, are you personally afraid of Gary Busey? <laughs> I'd like to spend one evening with Gary Busey, and that's probably about it, um, just to pick his brain on some some life questions. But uh, it looks wild, there's no doubt. I saw the picture. I don't think that uh, will affect us. I think it's a nice touch for them. Uh, whoever picked it, kudos for that, that crazy picture. Catch that graphic right over my shoulder on that massive jumbotron and keep an eye out for these bad boys, the paddles. They will be with the paddle people lined throughout the stadium, making quite a ruckus. It's something every Texas Tech player mentioned earlier this week at the press conference. David. All right, we appreciate it, Bailey. Make sure you watch out as well. Trust me, I spent many a years on those sidelines trying to avoid those paddles hitting my head <laughs> successfully, I might add as well. I did have fans grab cameras, though. That was quite annoying. All right, Texas Tech soccer opens up Big 12 play tonight against West Virginia.